So a lot of people are happy with the new Mario Party. So there's a new Mario Party game called Mario Party Jamboree. And of course it's going to probably sell very well because it's a game geared towards casual gamers. You know, casual game game no casual games have done pretty well on the Switch. Uh, Nintendo Switch Sports did pretty well. Mario Party Super Mario Party and Mario Party Super Style sold both 10 million. Ring Fit Events has sold 10 million plus. Okay, casual games have been selling the best they ever been. Except for maybe the Switch Sports because it's not selling as well as the Wii one. But the Wii one was bundled with the Wii. But why can't Nintendo make a Mario Party with a decent corny gotta be anymore? This is what you get in 20 turns now. Four or four or six coins on average. Mean that everyone wins 15 point turn coins per on turn per average. 15 coins. If you take account of your styles, but 18 styles it means that every player will have one 20 coins per turn on average. And yeah, these people are just like they just can't have fun. Okay, they have to have these little nitpicks that, like, almost no one cares about, like, basically, you know, Mario Party, like, in the older Mario Party games, coins were, of course, much more rare, but they made it where coins are much more common, so, you know, it can be more competitive, so one player doesn't run away with the game, you know, that is a, you know, I do love the older Mario Parties, but that has always been a problem in the older Mario Parties, is that one player can literally just run away with a victory, but anyone can catch up if they have enough coins or strategy or anything else in Mario in the newer games. And of course, you may not like the new Mario Party games, they might not be as good as the original ones, but they made it more balanced so anyone can win, okay, as well. But yeah, that's about this video here, and goodbye.